Hey, what up guys? This is The Daily Dose and we are back with another diecast news and update here showing you what's cool, what's new, and what's awesome but in this case, also what's sad in the diecast community but for, before we proceed, I'd like everyone to please give this video a like and also uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe to our channel. I upload frequently so please do also watch my other videos and click the bell icon so you guys won't miss my new uploads so first up here, this is a couple of the 9-pack exclusive Matchbox Datsun 510s right here in white and black. So these are uh, out right now in some stores worldwide. However, we still don't have this one here in the Philippines. So I'm just content looking at the, <laughs> looking at the photo here. So yeah, really good, good casting here and I think yeah, these look way better than the previous Datsun 510s that they released. I love this one, especially the black one. It looks really cool with uh, the uh, matching colorways here. And yeah, pretty outstanding release here. Both are really good cars. I love the black one better. Uh, what about you guys? Which do you prefer, the white or the black one? Kindly put a comment down below. And oh, by the way, you can see here, they have some difference. I think the white one has painted uh, windows I really can't tell here but yeah I think painted windows so that's a major bummer for this one uh, the black one has clear windows so you can actually see the interior quite well so yeah please do comment down below if this one here actually has painted windows or is it just because of the lighting here so yeah thank you in advance for that and next couple of beautiful Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 3 here this is from Eno 64 so the white one has two variants here one in plain white of course this one has some uh, hood vents here or yeah hood vents and the other one has a carbon fiber finish on the hood of course not this is not real carbon fiber okay just fake carbon fiber finish uh, both of these have the same um, body kits here interiors are the same both are right hand drives yeah so nothing much different here except for the hood and the wheels but this one I think comes with extra set of wheels like this one right here this was the previous release we'll take a look at this one and yeah, this is available available right now at hobby stock I'm looking at the Philippine shop by the way so price at around just 1200 pesos and that is around uh, more than 40 US dollars for you guys out there so this red one is the uh, red Philippine exclusive model and you can actually see here it comes with extra set of wheels so I think this this one also has an extra set of wheels oh yeah here it is here's the uh, description here it is available also at hobby stock Philippines so price less than the Philippine Philippine exclusive release so comes with separate decals and extra wheels so yeah it does come with extra set of wheels so this is a great casting I love the older evolutions uh, compared to the new one I love the form factor of the 90s JDM cars by the way and next yeah this is the sad news for you guys for us guys for diecast collectors so the uh, RLC exclusive 71 Datsun 510 uh, sale was postponed that was supposed to happen uh, yesterday but I think due to the uh, system uh, it was uh, postponed this picture by the way was I mean is from uh, Bob's Hot Wheels Australia and yeah this said here due to the circumstances currently beyond our control today's sale has been postponed we, we are able and oh something <laughs> so they will just uh, announce new sales plan soon so yeah quite sad a lot of you guys uh, were waiting for that uh, I was also waiting for that but I know my uh, chances of getting the RLC are it's quite slim because yeah, it's really tough to get the uh, these cars it just runs out in a couple of seconds so I was not getting my hopes too high but it's quite sad because of the postponement postponement here of the sale 
so a lot of you guys were pretty bummed about this one but anyways live moves on remember this is just a toy guys so uh, we'll just move on from this and uh, wait for the next time that uh, the sale will be available again for the RLC Datsun 510 here the next check out these beautiful matchbox castings here this uh, these are from the uh, Top Gun series the new one so 15 fighter planes in the series but we'll be talking about the first five here so we got the first one here we have the dark star yeah really really co cool here it has its stand also as you can see right here so yeah typically i'm not a collector of this type of casting or i'm not a really big fan but man these are beautiful these are quite new from matchbox also and uh, here's the enemy strike jet oh i love the colors on this i love the art and oh how come this doesn't have a stand quite confusing and uh, here's a super hornet hero here from boeing and looking really cool here man i love this one so far out of the three we've checked out i really like this uh, especially the tampos on this it looks really beautiful and then next we got a tomcat here so f14 tomcat maverick wow outstanding here man that is beautiful and then the uh, fifth one uh, for this video we got the lockheed here outstanding job here from matchbox really love the first five so far release and by the way they are now available in some uh, stores and also in some online shops in eBay now eBay prices are quite high but yeah I'm just telling you guys so if you don't want to go out maybe check out some online sellers but also check out the prices okay check out those competitive prices the next from Tomica here this is the new Tomica limited vintage Neo Mazda RX-7 type RSR uh, this is a beautiful 1997 Mazda RX here they call the paint job sunburst yellow so beautiful one I love this it's just a beautiful car I think again I've stated this in some videos ago the RX-7 is to me probably one of the most beautiful cars of all time it is just The car style just just doesn't get old. Yeah, it just it is just a beautiful car, and Tomica here has done a fantastic job with this one. So check this one out. Really simple, but it is beautiful. So this one has rubber tires because it is TLVN, and yeah, really great job here from Tomica, and then from MR Collection models right here check out their uh, F8 Tributo this is fantastic and by the way this is in 118 scale and uh, only 99 pieces of this is available worldwide so if you want this I uh, think just go in their official store that is atelier-mrcollection.com I'll just put the uh, link in the description down below so this is a masterful piece here from uh, MR Collection. It is just beautiful. Look at the details on this. Man, that is just fantastic. And whoo, look at the engine details. It is just stunning, man. Uh, that is just amazing. Here's some more uh, images of the FA Tributo here. Ooh, that is just stunning. Look at that. Look at the details. And look at the interior details here. Steering wheel. Man, amazing job on this one. The dashboard looks really good. And uh, from Tomica here. Take a look at some of their new cars here. This is from the Tomica shop. This is the Toyota 86 5 Command car. It looks beautiful. Love the paint job. It has some, it has some tempos here. It says Straz. And of course the Tomica shop logo right there. Opening doors and yeah uses the trademark Tomica wheels that some of you guys don't like but yeah, it's okay to me the next here's an Apita Fair Lady Z here with a British flag 
looking really cool. Again, uses the basic Tomico wheels right here. That again, some of you don't like. <laughs> and it, it has that huge British flag right there on the hood. And also on the door. Opening features also on this one as the door opens. Good colors here on the interior. And yeah, beautiful car. And both of these cars have suspensions like Tomica cars have. And last but not least, check out this new Eno 64 Nissan GTR R32 Pandem Toyo tires. Wow. So this is beautiful right here. So this is based on a real life car like a lot or if most Eno 64 cars are. And here's the real life car here. Looking really cool. And... This is the Eno 64 and I love the wheels. Check out the rims, man. That is just fantastic. That's one that's uh, some of the uh, most beautiful rims that I have seen uh, from Eno 64. It is just stunning, man. I love the temples also. The car is beautiful stance by the way. Yeah, so amazing car here. So that is all for today's news and update for you guys i hope you enjoyed this one and if you did please give this video a like and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel and see you soon on the next video i got another news and update for you guys coming out in a few hours so better stay tuned for that and uh, that is all bye bye guys peace out and enjoy the rest of the day